you remember our heroes were driving their herd of fishing worms through the gorge when they were confronted by a most dreadful sight, the what's that? A frightful monster so-called because whenever anyone sees it, they scream, Good, Good heavens, heavens what's, what's that? that? See, our heroes fled in fright and panic. Not to see, Pale Bill. While back at the gorge, the monster was gay and jubilant. Who's gay and jubilant? We're Boris and Natasha. Yes, the what's that was just a trick dreamed up by Boris Badenov, but of course our heroes didn't Know that. He's right behind us, Rock. I can hear the pounding of his big flat feet. Those are your big flat feet, Bullwinkle. Oh, so they are. Now let's just wait a second. Okay. That's long enough. Let's go. Hold it, Bullwinkle. I'm ashamed of us. We acted like cowards. Who was acting? We left our herd back there. True. Monster or no monster, we gotta go back. How come? No bless oh bleed. Get some tight. I mean it's our duty to meet that terrible monster face to face. We couldn't back up to him, huh? Come on, Bullwinkle. Duty call. And reluctantly, our heroes began to retrace their footsteps. They're coming back, Natasha. Quick, back into what's that custom? Oh, you're in already. Good. Now we can... Raskolnikov. Who's in there with you? Who's guy with the funny feet? Come out, you double grocer, and fight like men. Natasha, come out. Yes, darling. Natasha, you're out here. Darling, everybody's got to be somewhere. But who is in there? I don't know, but he's pretty cheesy disguised. Look, nose is all lopsided. Uh-oh. The two villains dashed away, madly pursued by the monster. Round and round the rough and rugged rocks, the ragged rascals rudely ran until they were able to escape temporarily. <laughs> Darling. I thought Fireside Crook Poop said what that was extinct. He did. Look right here. This frightening beast is now extinct. Turn page, darling. Almost. Oh, boy. Things look bad for Boris and Natasha until <laughs> the wily what's that, dizzy from chasing around the rock, collapsed in a heap. Let's go, Boris. Hold it. Hold it. Look who's coming. Sure enough, our heroes had returned to the worm herd. Well, we're back, fellas. Did you miss us? Let's get going, Bullwinkle. It's almost sundown. Right. And I certainly hope we don't see whatever it was we saw before. Whatever it was. And once more, our heroes began to drive their herd forward. Come on, worm. Get a wiggle on. But just a short distance ahead, Boris and Natasha were ready to go into their act again. Now, when I count three, we jump out and go, hoo-hoo, hoo-hoo. Got it? Got it, darling. Hoo-hoo, hoo-hoo. And Natasha. Yes? Next time you stand on my shoulders, take off high heels. One. Two. And a second later, right in front of the startled Bullwinkle. Uh, hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo. What's that? What's that? Hold your ground, Bullwinkle. Hold it. I'm froze to it. Hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo. Hoo -hoo. I'll get a stick and see if I can scare it away. But the plucky squirrel grabbed a nearby cactus and started for the menacing figure. Hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo, hoo -hoo. But what might have happened, we'll never know, for at that instant... <laughs> Crime in Italy. There's two of them. Yes, the real what's that had recovered and was bounding toward our heroes, its teeth flashing wickedly. <laughs> Don't miss our next biting episode, Choo Choo Baby, or stick to your gums.